Kylie Jenner is giving us a serious blast from the past following her split with Travis Scott as she allegedly hangs out with an old flame, but is it what it seems? What's up guys, it's Susan Morad back here on Clever News and before you get into judging, we've all been there before. Don't lie because you and I both know that the calling up an ex after a breakup move is usually the go-to move and according to initial reports, that's what went down a mere 48 hours after news broke that Kylie Jenner and Travis Scott had split. But is that really what happened? Okay, so let's back it up for a second. Kylie and Travis allegedly called it quits earlier this week and there have been mixed reports about why. Some are saying that it was over concerns that Travis was being unfaithful to her, while others are saying that the two simply had different priorities. Sources revealed to E! News that, quote, Kylie is young, but she really wants the traditional family life. She has seen her older sisters with big families and multiple kids, and she wants the same. She loved being at home with Travis and Stormy more than anything. But right now, their priorities are different. Sources say that the fact that Kylie wishes Travis was more dedicated to the family also played a role in the split. But for better or worse, he is busy with his career right now. They went on to say that it was hard for him to come home every night and be present in simply being with the family and putting Stormy to bed. That's not where he is right now, the source continued. It made Kylie insecure and anxious. The last few months, Kylie felt they were drifting and she was never really sure what was going on. Well, TMZ now reports to have the exact details on why Kylie and Travis split, according to a source very close to the couple. TMZ reports that it wasn't a result of a cheating scandal or some sort of big fight. To put it simply, their sources say it was because, quote, they fell out of love. Now that's pretty heartbreaking. They went on to say, quote, their decision to break things off came weeks ago, following a very long honeymoon phase that was full of love, touring, going on vacations, and of course, raising their daughter Stormy together. TMZ sources also went on to say, after Travis's Astro World Tour wrapped up and the two got back from Kylie's lavish birthday celebrations, everything slowed down and they were confronted by the grind of normal life and things felt very different between them. Anyway, now that we're all caught up with the breakup details, in comes Tiger. So for starters, the two have allegedly kept in touch since their split back in 2017, but very sparingly. Secondly, despite what you may be hearing, Kylie didn't actually call up Tiger a day after her split. According to sources, Kylie had a girls' night out on Tuesday night because what's a newly single girl to do in time of dire need than rally the troops? Kylie hit the town with her girls Stassi and Kelsey, as seen in like 95% of her Instagram posts, to West Hollywood hotspot Delilah. Naturally, sources close to Kylie revealed to E! News that Stassi thought it would be a good idea to get Kylie out of the house and get her mind off everything. The sources went on to say, quote, Tiger was with a few of their mutual friends at Sunset Marquis, where he's been working in the hotel's recording studio and invited Kylie and her girlfriends to come hang out, since they were already out. Small world. Right? Daily Mail reported that Kylie and her friends got into her blue Rolls Royce while leaving Delilah to head to Sunset Marquis. They also reported that Stasi and Kelsey later left the hotel via the same exit as Tiger around 3am and that according to an onlooker, Kylie left via a different exit. Despite what it might look like, the source went on to explain that this entire outing was absolutely not to get Travis's attention whatsoever, while another source revealed that Kylie seemed very content with her girls during their night out. Well, while everyone has been busy speculating on the details of this claimed meetup, Kylie herself has now taken to Twitter to set the record straight. In her first tweet, she said, quote, The internet makes everything 100 times more dramatic than what it really is. There was no 2 a.m. date with Tiger. You see me drop my two friends off at a studio that he happened to be at. She then followed up with a second tweet saying, Travis and I are on great terms and our main focus right now is Stormy. Our friendship and our daughter is priority. So while all these reports are blowing up online, it's great to see that Kylie took straight to social media to set her record straight. We do have to speculate that the split has been weeks in the making, considering that the two haven't publicly been spotted together since Travis's Look Mum, I Can Fly Netflix documentary premiere in late August. TMZ also reported that according to their source, they were told that Kylie and Travis tried to work it out for a while, including around the time she attended the premiere with him on August 27, but couldn't make it happen. Regardless, the two will continue to co-parent their adorable prodigy Stormy Webster, so that means we'll be getting toddler updates on the reg. Speaking of Stormy, TMZ just reported that neither Kylie nor Courtney and Chloe have written custody agreements for their children. 
This trend with not having custody agreements, however, is surprisingly a trend among the Kardashian clan and one that isn't top priority for the famous family. Sources revealed to TMZ that none of the sisters have ever signed anything regarding legal custody documents. And although this trend doesn't seem like the popular opinion among many parents who separate, it seems like it works out for them. But back to Kylie and Tiger, whether you want to believe reports that they just hung out or not, this actually isn't the first time the two have been reported to have a friendly run-in. Back in late August, Kylie and Tiger were both spotted partying it up at Vegas nightclub Sapphire. It appeared that Tiger was in town for a concert and an appearance at Jewel Nightclub just before heading to the Gentleman's Club Skybox Suites with his buddies and then directed to the karaoke room. You know, just a casual weekend in the life of Tiger. Just after his arrival, sources told Entertainment Tonight that Kylie arrived with her group of friends where they were escorted to the karaoke room and spoiler alert, where Tiger and his pals were also in attendance. The entire group were reportedly all in good spirits and partied until the early morning where both groups were seen leaving Sapphire together around 5 a.m. Clearly, what happens in Vegas doesn't necessarily stay in Vegas. In the end, we're all just rooting for Kylie and Travis's happiness, whichever path that may lead to. But right now, you guys, I'm really curious to hear all of your thoughts on this speculation of Kylie and Tiger's alleged meetup. Do you think these two will become close again? Or are you hoping Travis and Kylie can work things out? Let me know all of your thoughts in the comment section below. And while you're down there leaving comments, this is a time to subscribe to Clever News if you haven't before. Hit that subscribe button right there and also hit the bell to be notified the second we post an update on this story or any other story. And you can catch up on everything you missed right over here. I'm Susan Morad. Thanks so much for hanging out with me and I will catch you later. Bye guys.